the walk with senior wrestler Peter Thompson. Peter, thanks for being here this morning. What's the number one technique you need to do or master to become an elite wrestler? Uh, I'd say the number one technique would probably be a double leg. It's like a very common, super easy takedown. Uh, it works all the way from the lowest level all the way to the highest level, so I'd say that's probably one of the most fundamental things so you got to know. You're a two-time CIF placer. If you get your third here during your senior year, you set a school record three-time CIF placer. What do you need to do to meet that goal? Uh, I think I just got to keep training hard, listening to my coaches, showing up every day to practice, uh, keep lifting hard, and uh, just keep putting in the work. Great. Coach Heber is beloved by you guys. What is the number one thing that you've learned from him? Um, definitely just to keep showing up, keep working hard. I like a big part of success isn't how you do at the start, it's how you finish. So yep. do you think you could take him down if you guys wrestled? I think one of the best parts about wrestling is our coaches are actually like on the mat with us and they yep. do wrestle us from time to time. So I, I get to wrestle him a fair bit. I do not get very many takedowns. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's pretty good. And one last question, would you rather question if you're in a league championship, CIF championship match, would you rather be uh, dominating from the beginning or is there some exhilaration to being pinned and getting back up and basically taking that person down to win? Um, you know, I am of the opinion that I just want to dominate. So yeah, sure. I, I think start to finish, just completely show you're in control is my goal always. 100%. This is The Walk with Peter Thompson.